Hey everybody, Ace Trinaleem here. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Welcome back to the Pokemon Shield Quadlock. There's a Swoobat over there. And I'm dead annoyed because we're on Route 7. And if I recall correctly from the last time I recorded one of these, we caught a Swoobat. A Woobat, I should say, called Marshmallow. The unevolved form. Should I put Marshmallow in the party? I think I'm just going to stick with the team we've got at the moment. I'm going to remind myself of the team just while we're here as well. Uh, what have we got? We've got Ludicolo called Enchilado. We've got Chips the Corviknight. We've got Toxtricity, who is called Blueberry, who killed everyone. We've got Cabbage the Skun Tank, Fingers the Araquanid, our old faithful, and Mayo the Frostlass. So this is going to be jolly good fun heading up Route 7 now. I think we already actually went to the left if I recall correctly. So I'm going to keep going to the right. We faced this guy. That's the last guy we faced, wasn't it? Okay, so that's fine. Answer me the question today, which comes from me, which is, what do you think of the Pokemon Sword and Shield Expansion Pass? The Isle of Armor and the, um, the what do you call it? The Crown Tundra. To me, they look amazing. And I can't wait because we're getting even more Pokemon in Sword and Shield. And these games are my favorite Pokemon games. So to get even more storyline out of them is just amazing. The post. I wonder how long we can keep on carrying letters like this. Post will all be digital by 2025. I'm saying it now. It better be. There's no point. Apart from, like, parcels and stuff. Hello, Pelipper. It's time to get destroyed. In fact, I have just the Pokemon to destroy Pelipper. I love that it has Drizzle, so it instantly gets rid of the, uh, the hail. I like that. That's a nice touch. Let's get our Pokemon out, and let's get Blueberry into battle. I didn't realize, I just I just noticed I assault vested Blueberry. Did we do that last time? No idea. How you doing, Blueberry? You ready with that tailwind? That ain't gonna help you. I need to open my G Fuel. Oh, typo today, which is arguably one of my favorite flavors. Let's go overdrive. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, that's not me. I was like, oh, I'm doing a great move. No, I'm not. There's overdrive. Which should be powered up by Punk Rock if I have a... Oh, please tell me I got the Punk Rock uh, Toxtricity. Please. Oh, here's a Noctowl. Okay. Noctowl might know a Psychic type move, but I'm going to take the risk because we're 10 levels higher. Air Slash is fine. That's not very effective. Were you expecting a switch? Might flinch though. Yeah, it did flinch. That's annoying. Come on. Give me what I want. Oh, don't do this. Come on. Come on. This is my first time recording in like, recording in like a week and up. Come on, come on. Don't be like this. Okay, overdrive it is. Come on. Oh, I'm gonna have to use an awakening, aren't I? Otherwise, we're just gonna be asleep forever. And that would be very annoying. So, over to you. The rain has stopped. Does that mean, does that mean the hail comes back? Surely. Yeah, it does. I was gonna say, I'm sure the hail should come back. Right, let's get in our bag and let's go for do, 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 do. awakening. Yes, awakening is the way to go. There you go, Blueberry woke up. Let's get air slash. Then you're gonna hypnosis me again and put me right back to sleep. I'm gonna get well annoyed. Okay, buffed by the hail. Thanks, mate. Oh, we're in we're in a dangerous position though. But I think we can still do this. I don't think we're gonna have too many problems. Here's an overdrive. Thank you very much. That should be a knockout. Easy clap. Easy clap. Look at that. Beautiful stuff from a beautiful Pokemon. Let me know, by the way, your answers to the comments of the... Let's start again. Let me know your answers to the question of the day in the comments below. You can tell it's been a while since I've done this. And uh, tweet me your question of the day for everyone to answer with the hashtag ATLQOTD. You'll notice I did the quote of the day today. That's because, you know, I'm, I'm a bit... We're a bit behind on question of the day. We've, we've run out of, of good ones, so we need more. I've got, I've got one lined up. But other than that, they're all from me for the next few episodes because I need more. All right, let's get this guy. Hello, friend. Do you know the legend that says Galar is doomed if Corviknight ever disappear? I don't think that's true. I think you're a liar. Cabby, Jeffrey. What you got, Jeffrey? Oh, you got a Cor Of course you've got a Corviknight. Why would you say that thing if you didn't have a Corviknight? Right, Enchilada, you don't want any part of this. I'm too nervous to eat a berry. Right, well, let me switch. And I guess we bring in Blueberry. Blueberry is probably the better option, to be honest. Yeah, because your Corviknight ain't going to do much to a Corviknight. Really, Blueberry is the only option against Corviknight at this point. Realistically. Which is fine. We'll just get through this route as quickly as possible. Get ourselves to Winden. It's time to hurry up and get ourselves to the Pokemon League, even though we're kind of underleveled. I wonder if we've got any experience candy. Maybe I need to do some raids and stuff. Maybe I need to do some actual grinding, which would be nice. 
Okay, there's a knockout. Look at that. All right, that's what I didn't check. Okay, Corviknight's gone. Who's the next Pokemon? Oh, thank you. It's probably a Braviary or something, isn't it? Cabbage, thank you for leveling up. What we got? Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? It's Flygon. Oh. Okay, we do not want to be against a ground-type Pokemon. We want to bring in a Pokemon that will not have a problem with the ground-type moves. Let's go for you. Let's do that. Let's bring in Chips. Chips has been... Well, Chips is our starter, isn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So Chips is fine. Let's keep it going, though. Let's keep it going. Let's go for... I guess... Brave Bird would be good. Yeah, why not? Go on. Show us that Brave Bird animation. Look at that. Very nice. I actually liked Brave Bird more in the older games. Uh, Gen 7's Brave Bird animation was really, really nice. I mean, that one's still okay, but not as good. Don't don't flip me out. Oh, you flipped me out. Of course you did. Not Blueberry. Okay, Frost Last. Mayo can do this, probably. I mean, I'm immune to ice. I'm, I'm immune to hail. So we could we could try. Let's go for an Ice Fang. You're weak to ice. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Mayo's got it. Easy peasy. Look at that. Good night, Flygon. Thank you. Don't bring a Flygon, Randia. I mean, it's great training, I suppose, but you're going to get knocked out, Jeffrey. That's that's all I'm saying. you got to be careful of these things. Okay, who next? Who, who about to get messed up? Oh, I wanted to check real quick. Pokemon. Uh, Blueberry. Check summary. Oh, she has my he has minus instead of punk rock. That's such a shame. Punk rock's such a better ability than minus. Okay, what we got? We got Swoobats in here, we got Woobats in here. I love that we got the randomizer gave us Swoobat and Woobat in this area. It's, there's Bear Tick, but Bear Tick's normally there. Okay, this guy I'm not going to your camp. Who are you? Right, we just got trainer after trainer after trainer field. Whoa, a Pokemon trainer, what should I do? I don't really want to battle. Well, I mean, you could just let me walk on, mate. You could just jog on, couldn't you? Couldn't you, Donald? With your Giga Lift. Giga, 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 Giga Lift. All right, we ain't worried about no Giga Lift with Sand Street. There it is. We ain't no worry. We ain't no worried about no Giga Lift. Don't you worry, okay? We're gonna jump in with a Giga Drain. Could have faked it out, to be honest. But then that just means more sandstorm damage. Look at that. That's very nice. Iron defense. That's absolutely fine since I'm using special attacks. So your turn is wasted apart from me taking a bit of sandstorm damage. Which I'm going to recover on the next turn anyway because I'm going to knock you out. So that's alright. Here's that Giga Drain. Thank you. Down goes Gigalith. What a great Pokemon Gigalith is though. It's a really, really nice Pokemon to see. So down it goes. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. No problem. Mayo's level 44. Fingers is level 51, which is lovely. I'm buffeted by the sandstorm. Out comes Rhydon. Rhydon, mate, wants no part of Giga Drain. Let me tell you. Look at that. That's disgusting. That's horrible. I'm healed all the way back up now. Good night, Rhydon. Oof, I love Rhydon, though. What a great Pokemon. Apart from the two four times weaknesses, which are big issues, love me some Rhydon. Okay. Next on the agenda. Hello, sir. You look like quite the gentleman. Who you carry yourself? You are something. I am something. I'm somebody. Somebody once told me the world no. Mm hmm. Hilarion Darmanita. That's actually quite a, quite a big problem. I'm going to go ahead and fake out to start off with. You know, cheeky bit of tease. There you go. Oh, it was a good hit, though. Buffed by the hail. That's no biggie. Let's go for a Hydro Pump and hopefully hit it, please. Thank you. Very good enchilada. Can we take it out? Easy peasy. Darmantan's not got the greatest defenses, so that's one thing that helps, but... You have to be careful, because it's a bit of a scary Pokemon. Definitely watch the form fight on it. Hey, it's Phalanx! It's the crew! Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and go for another Hydro Pump. Don't you fake me out. Come on, hit it. Thank you! We're getting really lucky with Hydro Pumps in this playthrough. That's got to be said. Down goes Phalanx. All five of them. Beautiful. And that's lovely. Okay, so we're buffed. There's another Pokemon. Graplark. Okay. 
Hello, Graflox. You should have been a water type, and it's an absolute disgrace that you're not a water type. Oh, three Hydro Pumps in a row. Beautiful. It's not enough to take him down, though. Gonna use Octolock. Uh-oh. Can you not? It can no longer escape because of Octolock. Uh-oh. Do, 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 do. But down goes my defense and special defense every turn. Uh-oh. Right, Giga Drain. Let's get some health back. Octolock is a scary move. So Grappalock is down. I have healed a bit. I'm. Uh, we're going to level up. Enchilada's going to level up as well, which is nice. Go on. Go on. There we go. Level 54 for Enchilada. Are we ready for the Pokemon League? I don't feel like we are, to be honest. But we're going to have to be. This is going to have to be the team. Hello. Are you both going to fight us? It's been a while. I'm glad we can meet up again. Let's see how strong you've gotten. Great Pokemon trainer is really shy, but something special with their odd camera. Why was it on cam- Like, why was it on camera with a hyphen? When they're on camera? Like, I think you can say on camera without a hyphen. Okay. Ooh, enchilada and chips. Sounds lovely. Right. Uh, enchilada's not really got a problem with these Pokemon, but... Is that going to be a dry skin Heliolisk? Let's fake out the Heliolisk and let's switch Pokemon to... I want to send in Blueberry because Blueberry resists um, electric type attacks. But at the same time, you've got Dig and that's more important to me. I think, yeah, I think Cabbage can handle it, to be honest. I'm not too worried. So out comes Cabbage, lovely. There's the fake out. So no damage from Heliolisk. Thank you. Oh, that was great. Oh, Zap Cannon's going to hit, though. That's not good. Glad that's not my Corviknight, though. Oh, come on. Does Zap Cannon always paralyze, or was I just really unlucky there? Like, every time someone uses a potential paralysis move. Okay, everyone's getting buffeted by the hail, and that's mighty annoying. I'm going to go for a safe bet, which is I'm going to go for a paralyzed heal on Cabbage. Whilst Cabbage uses Dig on the Kling Clang. Okay, there's the Paralyze Heal. Excellent. Heliolisk is using Thunder, and that is terrifying. Uh oh. Okay, Cabbage, Cabbage, Cabbage. Oh, that's dangerous. Oh, that's dangerous. Cabbage, get underground and hide and don't come out. Shift gear from the Kling Clang. This could be bad for Cabbage. Can I use a potion on Cabbage while Cabbage is underground? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Uh, I might have to hydro pump the... Yeah, I might have to double in. Ooh, this is, this is scary. I feel like... I feel like I should hydro pump double into the Kling Clang so it can't do... Actually, maybe I should take out the Heliolisk. Because then the Heliolisk can't use any... Uh... It's a risky game. Because if Cabbage has been targeted by the Kling Clang, who now has increased attack... You may be looking at a... Yeah, do you know what? You might be looking in down the barrel of a gear grind. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's going shift gear, gear grind. So I'm going to protect Cabbage. Just to be safe. Oh, zap Cannon failed. That's good. Here's Thunder. That is going to hit, though. That is going to be neutral. On Enchilada! Ooh, that was not good. Critical hit. Oh, and Paralysis, you absolute... Dunce. That's a good hit on the Kling Clang. Okay, okay, no biggie. Kling Clang is buffeted. Kling Clang is in danger. Okay, Heliolisk is fine. Cabbage is okay. Enchilada is in a very dangerous place. Enchilada needs a max potion if we got one. We got any... We got max potion. Good, 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 good. Max potion on Enchilada. Thank you. And then you will go for... I'd say go for an, another dig on the Kling Clang, to be honest. It might be the safest bet. Get rid of the Heliolisk. I think the Heliolisk is the biggest problem here. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think the Heliolisk is the biggest risk. This is actually turning out to be quite dangerous. That Zap Cannon's going to hit. That's not good. It's okay, though. It's okay, though. Heliolisk using Thunder, and it's hitting again. And it's on Enchilada again. Oh, my days. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. No crits today. No crits. We get the free dig, which is good. So the... Uh the Kling Clang is as good as dead, okay? The Kling Clang is no longer a threat. I think my safest bet right now is to heal up Enchilada and then double in on the uh, the Helio list. This guy has more Pokemon, Liam, by the way. I, I just hope you know that. Yeah, I'm going to heal Enchilada. 
Okay. Take the two attacks from these horrible, horrible Pokemon. Yep. There's the Zap Cannon. That isn't going to hit. That's good. Here's the Thunder. That is going to hit. This Thunder... This Heliolisk is getting really lucky with these Thunders. It's okay, though. We're all right. Here's the Dig. So down goes... Oh, I went for the Heliolisk. I didn't even realize. Whoopsie. Okay, that's fine, though. That's fine. Heliolisk... Oh, because that was the bigger threat, really. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Everyone's alive. Clink Clang is going to go down on the next turn because of the Hail. So I don't really see a big problem there. Oh, this is scary, though. Noivern's coming in. i got to switch Enchilada out. That's that's a given. Enchilada, you need to switch to... Who's going to be good? Switch to Blueberry, I suppose. And then you are going to... Toxic the Noivern. Or just Night Slash. It's a Noivern. It's not going to be that strong, is it? Yeah, you're right. Okay, Enchilada comes back. No biggie. I love Noivern so much. Please don't kill me, Noivern. I love you. Kling Clang is going to use Screech and lower the defense sharply of my, uh, of my poor little... Oh, that's a hurricane. Okay. That's not going to be very effective. That's fine. And my poor little scun tank. Oh, of course you get the confusion because that's just what happens to me, isn't it? There's the Night Slash on the Noivern. It's a decent hit. Oh, that was a crit as well. That's a bit disappointing. Kling Clang is buffeted. We don't really have to worry about Kling Clang that much. But we do have to worry about the stat changes that have happened to Cabbage. So what I'm thinking is... I'm gonna go... This is a risk... No, don't do it. Don't do it, actually. I'm gonna go for a Poison Jab on the Noivern, and I'm gonna switch to... Chip. Because, because I feel like that's a good idea. I'm worried about a Zap Cannon from the Kling Clang, but I think Chips could probably take it, even though it's super effective. Or it could miss, which would be nice, but then the Noivern can't really do anything to Chips. Okay, Gear Grind, that's what I was thinking was going to happen. That's why I wanted to get... Because this is a plus one attack, Kling, uh, Kling Clang. And we had a minus two defense Skun Tank, and I was worried about Gear Grind. Hurricane is fine. Chips avoids it. Are we going to get the knockout, please? No, we're going to hit ourselves in confusion. That's fine. Kling Clang is buffeted. Kling Clang is out of the equation. So one hit on the Noivern, the Noivern's going to go down. So I'm not too worried there. That's, I can hit Noivern with literally anything and it's going to go down. It's very fragile. Everyone's doing good. Bunch of level ups there. Lovely, 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 lovely. What we got? Toga Demaru. Oh, God. Oh, that's not good. Okay, it's time to party. Right, it's time to go for a hyper potion on Blueberry to be safe. It's time to go for a hyper potion on Chips. Actually, it's time to go for a Hone Claws on Chips. No, I'm worried about the Togedemaru though, because the Togedemaru uses Zing Zap. Chips is done. It's a bit of a worry. I kind of want the Noivern to just get knocked out by the hail. That'd be great. I need to switch uh, Blueberry out because Blueberry can't really do anything to Togedomaru. Okay, Noivern's using Dragon Pulse. That's absolutely fine. That ain't going to do much, especially with that Assault Vest on. Togedomaru uses Zing Zap. Let's see how much it does to Chips. Okay, doesn't quite do half like damage to Chips, which is, you know, that's a good thing. But also, we don't want chips in this particular... In the vicinity of this particular battle. So I think the best thing to do... Is use a hyper potion... No, no, cabbage Cabbage can survive a couple hits, I think. So I'm going to bring in cabbage. Instead of blueberry. And then I'm tempted to bring in enchilada, but I don't want enchilada to have to suffer against Togedemaru. I'm worried it's got Iron Barbs as well. So I think what I'm going to do for this turn is I'm going to heal... I'm going to heal up Enchilada. Then on the next turn, I'm going to heal my Corviknight. Because then we're getting rid of the Noivern, basically, with the Hail. And then I'm going to bring in Enchilada to deal... Oh, Super Fang. Oh my, okay. Not terrible. Okay. Okay. Here's the Zing Zap on my Corviknight again. No. Oh my. They doubled into Cabbage? Are you for real? Oh my god. Well, they didn't know it was going to be Cabbage, to be fair, but they doubled in on 
They doubled... Oh, my God. Oh, 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 3 HP. They doubled in on what they thought was Toxtricity. Uh, 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 uh. Can we, can we get some healing on Cabbage, please? Uh, Chips, I'm going to switch you. I can't switch to Enchilada yet. I'm going to just have to heal up Chips. That's what I'm going to have to do. Just heal Chips with a Hyper Potion. The Noivern's going down, like, within the next turn. But, oh, my God. I've got to be really careful. So there's the healing. There's another Hyper Potion. Oh my god. This team, man. There's Hurricane. Oh, on Chips. Oh no. Oh no. No. Okay, Fell Stinger will not kill. Fell Stinger will not kill. That's okay. Okay, Noivern, you are done, right? Almost done. Almost done. Okay, oh my god. Oh my god. What am I doing? Right, I'm going to heal up Cabbage again. Why are they targeting Cabbage so much? Uh, okay, so let's go for a Hyper Potion on Cabbage. In the meantime, let's go for a, a Hone Claws on Chips, you know. Because then Chips can start using Power Trip on the Togedemaru. After a couple of Hone Clauses. Hone Clauses? Hurricane hitting again. Oh, no, no, no. No, no. Oh, my God. Please, please use things up on my Corviknight. I don't care. Just use anything you use. Use it on the Corviknight. Thank you. That's fine. I'll take that all day. I'll take that all day. Noivern's gone. Okay. Holy. This has been stressful. Damn, dude. Okay, Togedemaru and we're, Cabbage is going to get buffeted. That's fine. Right. The plan is that... Okay. Cabbage is going to dig. and Because that's going to kill the Togedemaru. You are going to use a Hyper Potion on Cabbage. Because Cabbage won't outspeed Togedemaru, I don't think. I'm pretty sure Togedemaru is faster than Skuntank. And I am right. And I have... That was a perfect play right there. If I had not done that... My, my skun tank would have died. I took a risk there, and it was the correct risk to take, and I'm very happy with that. Oh my word. Right, so all I need to do now, actually, is I just need to heal up my Corviknight. I can just use a high... Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 chips! We gotta kill the we've gotta kill Togedemaru now. We gotta. I hit Hyper Potion on the wrong Pokemon. It's done. It's okay. Mistakes were made, but we Iron Barbs. Okay, it's on cabbage. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Togedemaru's down. We're okay. Everybody survived. We made it. Holy moly. Blueberry leveled up to level 58. Blueberry's got to carry me through the league, man. And rightly so, after Blueberry did so much damage. Okay, it's time to heal up a little bit. Cause we're all a bit worse for wear. Well, not all of us. Some of us. Uh, let's go for a Paralyze Heal on Enchilada. Let's go for... Do I... Uh, can I sort my potions and stuff by type? Yeah, we, do, we don't have anything, mate. <laughs> we don't have anything, mate. At all. Right, Chips, you're back to full health. Okay. Let's hope the next battle isn't so uh, arduous. Oh, there isn't a next battle. Oh, well, that's good news, because I need to go to a Pokemon Center ASAP. Hey, look at all the Corvus Squire. Oh, thank fook. And here we are, in the city of Winden. Nope, and then abrupt music stop. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Let's go. Here we are, look. We're in Winden. And Hop's suddenly with us. Beautiful. Thanks, mate. Wow. It's like, it's like everywhere in London. <laughs> I mean, yeah, there's there's the wheel and everything. There's Big Ben. Beautiful. It's time to go to the Pokemon League, boys and girls, and everything in between. Oh, my. Well, you got something to say, Hop? Maybe? Maybe? Oh, Galarian Mr. Mime. All right, Wind and Sea, this is the place where I've become a legend at last. You get it, don't you, mate? After all, I'm about to become the new champion of the Galar region. Yeah, you reckon? That's it, I'm headed straight for Wind and Stadium. Don't waste too much time, Ace. You should head there yourself. Uh, I guess I'm gonna. Oh, boy. It's league time. I need to go heal, though. Big time. So I wasted those potions, but I can buy more, which is good news. I think it's time 
to stop buying um yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna sell some treasures it's time to stop buying um do we have any treasures we got a big pearl times two yeah we got a few it's time to stop buying full restore uh no it there you go you got there in the end it's time to stop buying hyper potions and start buying full restores because that's what you're going to need in the league uh, Ultra Balls, we, we're not really going to be catching much anymore. because we, we, No, we've caught something on every route. There's, there's, Apart from the Slumbering Weld, there's nothing left to catch. So, I guess we could get 10 Ultra Balls. They're not really needed now. We could have done that after the League, so a bit of a waste. But we will buy... I'm going to go in with 50 full restores. I think that's fine. Actually, we could do, like, super... We could do some Hyper Potions just to be, you know... Let's go for 30 Hyper Potions total. Just so we're safe in the league. You could call it overkill. I don't care. I'm gonna I'm going in with overkill. Luxury ball, repeat ball, HP up. It's a bit late for vitamins now, to be honest. Let's heal up. Get everybody healed. And oh my word, it's time to go to the stadium. Start the league, boys! This is our team. We're taking to the league. I'm not convinced we're gonna win, to be honest. Really. Uh uh, I'm scared. I'm a bit scared. But it's okay. We're just going to try our best. Right, let's get to the stadium. Oh, we have to go on the monorail, don't we? I think. Is that right? Pretty sure we take the monorail. Do we? Are you sure? I think we can. Hello, can I take... Would you like to go to... Winden Stadium? Rose of the Rondelands Hotel. Hmm, very interesting. Now then. It's time. I wish we got to see the monorail in motion. That's that's a gripe I have. As much as I love a black screen, because they, you know, didn't feel like animating. Uh, gonna heal in here, just so that we've used this Pokemon Center. I'm guessing you probably only have to enter it, but still, it's nice to, you know, it's nice to just double check. Make sure everyone's super duper healed. Alright. It's time to go. Can I, uh, can I leave? Can I just go to the stadium and get the, you know, get the initial cutscenes out of the way, I suppose? Yeah? How about it? In we go! We've made it to the league, lads! Oh, boy. Hello, Hop. Oh, it's Ball Guy. You, you got stuff for me? I have a Pokeball for you. Thanks for the dream, Ball. Thanks, mate. Cool stuff. Cool stuff's happening. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okie dokie. Right. This is the reception desk. Turns out I was the first to register for the Champion Cup. In other words, I'm already number one. Oh, okay. Ace, correct. I've been watching over your performance in the League Challenge. This is a formality course, but I need to check your gym badges if you don't mind. Also, I'm all sorted and ready to battle you on the biggest stage of them all. But it looks like Bede couldn't make it. Hard luck. Somehow I didn't think he'd just, uh, he'd just take being disqualified lying down. You know what I mean? No. I guess it is what it is. Come on, Ace. We should head to the locker room. Oh, boy. Let's head to the locker room. It's gym time. Attention, gym challenge. We've made it through to the gym challenge. The semi-finals will be starting soon. Please head to the stadium pitch when you are ready. <gasps> Holy moly. Are you at... Oh, I can't enter there, apparently. Oh, mate. No one's in here. No one's ready to fight me. Very curious about who will win among the four who compete in the gym challenge. When you're ready, please head to the pitch. I'm going to head to the pitch real quick. Because this is just like an introduction thing, isn't it? This isn't the actual... We don't we don't start the semi-finals yet, do we? Like, isn't there just a bit of a presentation? Like, these are all the trainers. Oh, no, no. We're about to fight Marnie. We just we just fight Marnie off the get-go. I can't... I couldn't remember. Oh, okay. Well, in that case... I know you get all the badges and meet me here. I know there's been a lot between us with my big brother, Team Yell, helping. Spite me for all that. Well, the truth is, when it's all said and done, I really just want to become champion for myself. So don't take it personal when I kick your butt. And that, on that cliffhanger, is where we're going to leave it. We're going to fight Marnie at the start of the next episode. So join us then. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button. If you're new, hit the subscribe button. Use code ACE for money off G Fuel. And until next time, I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Keep on training.